Hello students, my name is Dr. Erig and I'm a teacher here at Cobb Online Learning Academy in Georgia and I'm going to help you prepare for the Algebra EOC. Now this is the first year that we're giving this new version and I know you're going to do great and what we're going to do is first of all I want to make a little disclaimer. Thank you for the hundreds of websites that I screen grabbed stuff from just to help you be successful. I didn't keep track of where I got the pictures but um, I pretty much didn't grab anything. I grabbed great resources from hundreds of sites, including the Department of Education, just to help you be the best that you could possibly be. Now, let's take a look at this first slide. So notice here, this little guy, we should come up with a name with him. I don't have a name yet, maybe like Kelki or something. Anytime you see that, that's a hint. You need to have your calculator open, okay? I'm not going to put a calculator link on every page, but when you see that guy, you need to have the calculator open. This link right here will take you to the practice calculator. If you want to be super fancy, you can click choose assessment and go down to Georgia. And then this will be the actual perfect examples of what you'll see. But the practice calculator is definitely good enough. The cool thing is for the algebra test, you have access to both the scientific and the graphing calculator, which is going to help you with a lot of the questions of your test. Moving down here, I have copied and pasted in the formula sheet, but even just to make your life amazing, anytime we do a topic that relates to the formula sheet, I've already copied and pasted the formulas in the boxes. So you'll know, oh wait, arithmetic sequence, like I need to pay attention to these formulas on the formula sheets. So anytime that you see the white box on a slide, you know that these questions are on the formula sheet that you will able be able to access when you actually take the EOC. So I'm gonna be honest with you. To do this well and to really, really study for your test, you are gonna need some paper. I do not want you to watch me like you are watching a gamer playing Minecraft, Fortnite, or Call of Duty, no. You are going to watch me like I am your teacher wherever you are. And like a good student, you're going to take notes. So there's a whole lot of notes going on. So just grab yourself a notebook. Get ready to take some notes. The more notes you take, the better. If you just watch me passively, I'm going to tell you right now, your grade is not going to be as high as it could be if you took notes. Anytime I open up the calculator, guess what you should be doing? open up that calculator and follow along with me. Now, let me give you one more little hint. I want to teach you how to split your screen on a PC. I don't know how to do it on a Mac, but you can Google it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put my left click and I'm going to pull this tab down. See how this tab is kind of like flying in the air? On a PC, on a Windows computer, you're going to hit the Windows key and you're going to hit the right arrow key and that's gonna zoom that window to the side. Then you're gonna pick, what do I want on the other side? Guess what you want? The calculator, okay? So make sure you have your screen split because that'll be so much easier when we're typing in formulas that you can have on one side, you can have this going on, and then on the other side, you can have that. The other option you could do is if you do wanna keep your or er, the calculator connected, the other option is you could have the video playing split screen and have your work on the other side. So that way you can pause the video as you go. Let me tell you, you can do it, but it's gonna take some time for you to be amazing. And let me tell you also, I believe in you. All of your teachers know that you are an exceptional person and you can ace the Algebra EOC. And even if you don't, okay, then now we know what you don't know so you know what to work on for next year.